Carroll County Deputy Taylor Bristow was shot and killed in the line of duty last month. Hundreds of family members, friends, and community members attended his funeral to pay tribute to his life today. Yeah, but now scammers have used that very funeral to take people's money. Fox News' Kevin Stewart joins us live with a warning from the sheriff's department. Kevin? Bristow gave his life protecting and serving this community, so investigators say they are not going to let this scam case go. The Carroll County Sheriff's Department is grieving and hurting for the family of fallen investigator Taylor Bristow. Now this, a Facebook scam. They're still dealing with such a tremendous loss, so just having this added as extra stress during this time was absolutely detrimental. And we cannot express enough how sick it makes us. A Facebook post from a page labeled Taylor Bristow Funeral Service live stream has been shared all over. It asked people to donate. Sheriff's investigators reached out to the high Tower funeral home to verify its legitimacy. She asked, is, is this y'all? Is this a scam? And I said, no, ma'am, that is absolutely not us. This is 100% a scam. Investigators believe the scammer pulled the information, pictures, and stream from the funeral home. Someone had taken that information out of the obituary, had even used his wedding photo as the profile picture, and was sending friend requests out to all these people to donate to the family. Investigators hope no one fell for the con act. I have not heard that anyone actually donated money. It's heartbreaking. It's such a vulnerable moment in time when people try and take advantage of this. Just as Bristow will not be forgotten, investigators say they won't back off of what has proven to be a tough investigation. We are looking into some leads and some different avenues that we have of investigating that, but a lot of times these are offshore, overseas accounts, and once you give that money, it is so hard to trace those. Now, the funeral home director says this is not an isolated case. She says one of their other families had a similar incident happen to them just last week. If you have any information about any of these cases, you are encouraged to call the Carroll County Sheriff's Office. In Carrollton, Kevin Stewart, Fox 5 News. Unthinkable uh, how someone could take advantage of a tragedy like that. Kevin, thanks for the information.